Top of the tonight. Guess what? I know it's been a little while since we didn't post something on YouTube, but we were down. We back rolling now. So we keeping up with the content. Today what we got in the office. We have a very beautiful 2011 Escalade. With the Chevy Heart, of course. Big six deuce in this thing. And what we had was a failed AC clutch, as you can see. Uh, I definitely will post a video of it running ramp. This damn thing was crazy. Um, and this is just common failure. You know, I never seen one this bad in a while. I did one like this years ago in a suburban. It was this bad. You just don't see them this bad on you know all of them. But hey, every car is different. So what we're doing today is we're going to replace it. As you can see, we got the good old new, genuine new AC Delco part. And that remanufactured, not none of that. We got a brand new one in here. So we're going to go ahead and show you step by step on how to get it off. All right. So top of the tin up, as y'all can see. We are back at it, doing what we doing best. Well, do what we do best, and that is keeping these Chevys on the road, regardless of the emblem on it. You all see that motor right there. You know that is a Chevy product, and that's the big six deuce, baby. All right, what this one is in for is a broken AC compressor. You usually don't see them this bad. I'll show you more pictures when I get the ball over here. But today, showing you how to really ain't got no quick tips or nothing like that what i usually do is i'll take you know um all of this here all so i have better access to it but because this is a new environment or a newly you know a newly um um newly built property in this hoa and all that man i don't need my customer getting fines and shit for something of that nature. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to do a clean job today. It's gonna take us a little extra time because it won't be as fast, but you know, just go ahead and have to do it a, a cleaner and efficient way. But as you all know, I'll show you guys how to do it from start to finish. So let's get into it. First thing you want to get into, you got four 15 millimeter bolts on this thing. You want to get those on, start over here, this one right here. That one back there, uh -oh. that one right there. And you have two underneath the bottom. One you will have to get underneath the vehicle to get up there and get it. I advise you to get a um, a speed ratchet. So that may, you do not need to be sitting there and just turning, turning. Cause sockets will not get back there unless you have like some super special slim 15. But yeah, you take those four 15 millimeter bolts off, you drop it down. And disconnect it and you're going to need to evap the freon if there's freon still in the system um i don't have my freon evaporator with me at the present moment well the ac machine at the moment so i'm going to do it the old school way just let it out and uh yeah yeah you shall see how i did that in a second all right so let's get into it let's break it up. all right as you can see she is off and word of uh word of advice the two, the two lower boats underneath the two lower boats underneath you need to have them on there when you're putting the ac compression back because if you don't you're there's physically no way to put those boats in once you have the ac compressor in its place right there understand me all right it's off and now that it's off Let's go ahead and prep the new one and yeah, put this one back together. All right. As again, this is going to be the hardest boat to do if it is a four wheel drive. 
So what you need to do is take off the splash guard right there so you can get your arm up and then once you get your hand up in there and you take this last board out, you know, it's gonna, you know, it, it's a, kind of a pain in the ass if you have four-wheel drive, but, you know, and there's really no tips to show you to get around it. It's just, you gotta go through with it. But there it is, got it out. As you can see, this clutch has gone bad terribly. And this is the prime reason why the client was having some chaotic issues when this was spinning, this thing was but old uh, old and busted, new buttery hotness. All right, I'm gonna go hop in the truck for about 10 minutes and warm up and come back out and go ahead and knock it off. I flip a band to a A, yeah Peeping eating good, he need Versace on his plate I got the grand, I got the grand I dirty dance on Figaro, Figaro Out in the 